Time in nature restores balance. It's healing. It roots us and connects us to one another. Nature offers the best lessons. She's the best teacher. I hope this video inspires you to get outdoors with your children. In today's video, I am sharing with you five of my favorite nature walk activities with my children. Come along on a nature walk with us. A nature table or seasonal table is a table or shelf in our home where together with our children, we create beautiful scenes that represent the rhythms of the seasons. It's become a tradition in our home that speaks a deep reverence of nature's rhythms. My children are always excited to get outside exploring nature and to bring back some beautiful nature treasures to display on this corner of magic. Just as much as we love collecting nature's treasures for our nature table display, we also love collecting treasures for crafts. Uh, there are so many crafts, so many ideas that you can find on Pinterest or several craft books that you can find online inspired by nature. And before I forget to mention it, there will be a part two of this video where I share our favorite books and resources, not just for nature crafting, also for nature studying and just resources that inspire us to get outdoors in general. But one of our favorite crafts is a super simple craft that will motivate your babies to get outdoors. So collect treasures like wildflowers, twigs, interesting stones and leaves, seashells. And when you get back home, attach them to a stick with yarn and you've got yourself a treasure stick or wand. Our family picked up foraging about two years ago and it's one of our favorite hobbies to do outdoors. I will say that before you begin to forage for plants or fruits you'll be consuming, uh, you should purchase yourself a guide or a book for foraging in your specific region. We've foraged wild oranges and blueberries, blackberries for juices, edible flowers for salads, and wild coconuts. I'm pretty sure that my youngest would vote on Play-Doh imprinting as their all-time favorite nature walk activities. We provide everyone with a ball of our homemade Play-Doh. And by the way, I am going to leave a recipe to our dough down below. It's the best recipe we've tried and I guarantee you'll never purchase Play-Doh again. As I was saying, each person will carry their ball of dough uh, and will bring it on a walk with us and just uh, find interesting items in nature to imprint in the Play-Doh. Guarantee your littles will get super creative with this and it leads to discussions of patterns and textures and symmetry. Just such a fun activity. Our family has this little game where we're always looking for letters in nature. You'd be surprised with the interesting findings you'll come across. We keep a list of the letters we have found so far and while it may be a while before we find the entire alphabet, it's a fun nature game we have going on. Like, like, Jacob? Jacob. Jelly. Jam. Scavenger hunts are always a big hit and open-ended. There are so many variations and possibilities. You can find free printables online along with inspiration for super neat scavenger hunts you can create on your own. Many don't even require from much planning or bringing anything along. Like an ABC nature walk, how many things can you find in nature that begin with the letter A or B or C and so forth? Uh, nature walk bingo, walk and count, foraging for colors, a five senses walk. What do you see? What do you hear? What can you taste and touch? Uh, searching for animal habitats like dens and nests is one of our absolute favorite activities when we don't want to bring anything along. An opposite its walk is always fun. Find something that's rough, find something that's smooth. 
I strongly and passionately believe that teaching our children about the natural world should be treated as one of the most important events in their lives. If we want our children to care for the world, we must teach them how to fall in love with nature.